Good morning, everybody. It is freezing cold out here. We are getting ready for our day. So a lot of people, Brent, have requested to see a video of cold start equipment. So I figured I'd record while you give it a pull. And we want to show them what I was talking about in the previous video, how hard it is to get this sucker started. Uh, this boy right here. First of all, make sure you choke it. Yeah, <laughs> make sure you choke it, turn the key. Yeah. Make sure all your... <laughs> that was frozen too, wasn't yeah, it? Man, choke <laughs> All right. So he's got the key, he's got the choke, and this is why I... Only thing I really dislike about these 48-inch walk-behinds. It's probably a 10-minute video. <laughs> <laughs> Just be easy with that rope. I mean, are you, if you're over here, let me go this way. Yeah. If Let's I see. Fall, slip, now we're don't, leave. don't fall now. I put your foot down. Yeah. <laughs> Look at that. You see that? I mean, it is frozen. There is just. And, 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 I mean. It, oh. Yeah. I mean, you're gonna have to just be patient with it, and 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 just several times. Just don't break that cord. <laughs> I mean, this is what I was talking about, guys. The choke is on, the key is turned, the choke's all the way up, but, yeah. And, and you know what? We, in this industry, when we're pulling up at a job, we shouldn't be fighting this. You know, you should have a key right here somewhere, you choke it, turn it, and go. It's got plenty of gas. Just the moving. Yeah. Yeah, just the moving. Well, figured I'd give a, a good workout to Brent here. <laughs> I mean this is this is what I was talking about. I wanted to show you guys. It's it's just it's I don't know. You know, I, that's one thing I dislike. It's, they're great mowers. I just think Skag could have done us a favor and put a little battery somewhere and just freaking put a key on it. And I got two of these, so I found out the hard way. In the summer, as I mentioned in one of my other videos, in the summer, it's fine, it's warm. You know, you just choke it, especially in the morning and, and fire it right up, maybe two, three poles. But this, you shouldn't, you know. So the video here is about almost three minutes, so you've been fighting it for three minutes now. Well, the only way it'll warm up if you keep turning that because what it's doing is moving that oil around inside. I mean, maybe, I think maybe if you step, yeah, because you see the way this is turned, you're kind of fighting also the pull. No, no, don't go up, don't go up. I'd stand. Yeah, I'd, I'd stand there. Yeah. There you go. See, it's a little easier. But either way, even though that's a little easier, he, <coughs> it's still uh, it's still very, very frozen. I mean, we need to get it started because the job we're about to go to, we need it. So whether we do it here or whether we do it at the job site. Oh, this is this is what we were talking what I was mentioning to you guys the other day in one of the other videos. Ah, this is ridiculous. Go ahead and give it a little break and do the 36 and the 61 because they want to see cold start on all of them. And I think you're going to have no issues with the 36 and the 61. You just choke it and turn the key. And you can see how cold it is, guys. There's frost all over. And that's going to be easy. How about that 61? Am 
might want to take your glove and clean that seat because yeah. it's nothing but ice. <laughs> Now, I'm sure Brent, you know, but just in case you forgot, and maybe people who, who are watching don't know, on these fuel injected, there is no choke. So, when you turn the key, you just turn it to a half position and let let it come on, and you actually hear the little. Mm. There you go. So as I was telling you guys, no problem, no problem. I'm not gonna worry about the push mower, but big problem. And the other one does the same thing. And uh, I'll give it a try again. There's the key. Pull the choke. There you go. It wants to. Wow. Alright, take over. It's almost I, I'd go where you were down, sir, because I'd hate for you to slip. Because it's it's almost there. There he goes. Oh. guys this is something we fight with every morning when uh, when we're uh, starting early and uh, if it happens to be real cold that morning and it shouldn't be that way I shouldn't have to fight with a mower to get it started if everything works on it of course just because it's cold but I guess that's what the way they made them and it is what it is, but um, would I recommend the mower? Absolutely, the mowers are great. I mean, you know, you want to have a walk behind regardless, but I just think they, they should have put a little battery somewhere, made a little room, and put a little key start, and uh, it, would, it would make life so much easier. Because I always do this at home, or we try to at least, could you imagine pulling up at a customer's yard and you're starting trying to start a mower for about 10 minutes now which is how long this video is I uh, yeah that, that would be uh, no fun I can see a customer looking at us out, out the window going wow they're fighting with their mower <laughs> so alright I just wanted to make a quick video show you guys some cold starts I had some People ask me about it, so uh, I'll probably do it on the Hustler and on the other walk behind another day. <coughs> Figured I'd do it on these three because that's the three that we're using. And uh, this one was a little hesitant, but it fired right up, no problem. That one also very, very little hesitant, but then it fired right up. But this one, man, this one is a piece of work. See, now it's warmed up. So. Anyway, 
that is it we're getting ready to roll and hopefully it's not going to be a long day today uh just got a couple of bigger size properties but that's why we're bringing bringing the big boys and uh, we're gonna knock it out and go on but it's time for it to warm up isn't it Brent? this is ridiculous this is ridiculous so move to florida <laughs> Well, what messed us up is the February was 70 degree weather and here's March with like 20 degree weather. So, at least in the mornings. And then the highs are about 40. I think today high is what, 50? So, it's, it is moving on up, but not as fast as we'd like. All right guys, hope you're having a good one. Go get some money, stay safe out there. And I will talk to you guys later. Take it easy.